I did it! And I'm excited! Okay, she's so little! <laughs> hey everybody, I hope you're having a fantastic day. In case you're new to my channel, my name is Chris. It's so nice to meet you. And to all of my longtime subscribers, thanks for coming back! Alright y'all, so real quick, like for real, I just popped the camera on. But I had to tell y'all what just happened! What just happened? What just happened? So today, February 28th, let me check my Fitbit to make sure that that's right. February 28th, 2017, I went to the barber with Ty. He got his hair cut and so did I. Okay. Yes. <laughs> and I don't know when I'm posting this. Um, and I think like my boxy charm video, I was wearing the same exact top, but this is a completely different day of I'm just rocking the same top again, but yes. So literally I just wanted to show you exactly what I'm working with right now. I haven't washed it out or anything like that. And I have a ton of like those little teeny hairs that just get on everything. Um, but I just wanted to show y'all real quick because this is kind of a big step for me. I haven't gone to the barber or a salon in like years so it was a very interesting experience and i'll definitely be talking about that in another video but this one in this video i just want to show y'all what i got done <laughs> all right so check it out she is like really short like ultra short yes and the back of my hair is finer you can see right here so it's kind of like in a fade back there <laughs> kind of in a fade on the sides but I do have my topic fibers in that I use all the time because y'all know I'm still going through like this hair loss thing um and I I don't know I don't even know what I have left at this point but the fibers save my life <laughs> like literally without them I don't know what I would do so I do have those in up here but without them like you can basically see like scalp it's short like really short um but I'm so excited like my hair was not this short when I first big chopped years ago. Like, it was not this short. But the back, y'all, is, like, ultra short. I'm really surprised that I like how everything is just playing out and laying out. I'm sorry. I'm looking at the viewfinder, y'all. This is just so new to me because I remember when I first big chopped, I was all about huge earrings and everything like that. And, you know, the length was kind of a shock, but not, like, it wasn't, like, traumatic or anything. But it was definitely different. But I have grown so much. I believe as a person over these past you know four years four and a half years that I mean my outlook on my hair is just so different now and I don't care if she is short like I love it I have embraced my shrinkage for so long that I think that it's just helped me I just I feel fine like I feel like myself you know what I mean um, and I'm not rocking the hoops today <laughs> so I'm just so excited and I'm just I'm just hoping that the hair loss stops so that I can begin to move forward but again I had to do what I had to do and I've been trying to be transparent on here and let you know what's going on on here as well as social media and stuff like that so be sure to follow me on my other social media platforms because I do updates there as well um, and pictures and stuff like that so you can see what's going on in between videos uh, because it's just quicker to do it there but strange thing is I don't really know like anything about the length of my hair right now like I don't even know how long it is right now I heard him say that he used like a wand or something back here and that's that's really short um but he also used the clippers on the top to kind of skim it but I don't know what I have right now I hope he remembers because I'm going to be going back to him <laughs> but thank you so much Pete for hooking Miss Fro up you did a fantastic job okay yes but yes I definitely want to come on here to let you know um here on YouTube what I've done Okay, what did I do? What did I do? No, I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm so excited. Like, no regrets. No regrets at all. I've already been loving the cut life since, you know, cutting my hair back in January. The maintenance is so much easier for me, and it's just really freed up a lot of my time um, and a lot of my worry. My worry has simply been, you know, hey, can you stop falling out at the top and in the front? Yeah, that's my worry, um, not the length. So, I am excited and again she's not even like defined or anything like that she's literally picked out um, and there was a time when I did not like to wear my hair like this usually I prefer to rock my full shrinkage with some sort of definition and whatnot so 
the fact that I feel so good with my hair like being not defined at all it's just it's just such a blessing like I'm so happy that I'm here mentally and I feel beautiful right now like I really do y'all so I don't know if y'all like it or not <laughs> but I love it honestly I feel like Miss Fro looks beautiful right now so that is just a blessing for me to have gotten to that point because again it wasn't always like that for me like not at all but all right I'm rambling I have to go I have to go get blower today so yes I just wanted to come in here and let you know what I did and I will see you very soon in another video take care <laughs> be sure to check out my channel homepage for lots more to watch And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more. Have a great day.